Hello. Glass of cannabis. It's been a glorious year. I want someone in here to stand to their feet and tell me their best way to smoke. Who will it be? Do you want to know what your name goes? Not him. It don't really matter when we all agree. What's your best way to smoke? Cause I'm rolling, 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 I'm
mm-hmm. in your wreck. In so the you glory mean, days. So, type yep. Shit. And yeah. everybody would come in with, with the Daniels wreck. Facts. Facts. <laughs> You'd only need that like 25 bucks. Yeah. And your head hurt. Right. Simple. Back hurts. Yeah. Can't sleep. Yep. Everybody yep. knew. <laughs> um, then later on, I uh, stopped working there. Then my friend had asked me to manage uh, his shop, and it was still on that wreck and ID time. So it was like, all right, uh, do that. And so I was like running the shop for a minute. That had closed down. And then they had opened a grow. So I was working at a grow facility. So I actually got my hands dirty with all that. So that was actually uh, really interesting being yeah. behind the scenes right. for the first time. And just really, like I said, get dirty. Because it really is a dirty job to um, grow. maintain yeah. that and look after it. Clean up. Um, get the new badge if you're really like in rotation like that. So that was cool. And how, then, how uh, deep did you get into it though? As I far as I learned a little bit, but I mean I I won't I'll be honest. I just really did most of the commands. But every once in a while, when I had the mop, it'd be like, so um, vegetation, huh? Tell me about that. Right. right. <laughs> <laughs> That's what's up though. Yeah. You know, just just learn a few things. So a couple of things here and there stick. Um, after that, uh, the um, pandemic came. Uh, that was bullshit. So I was trying to find jobs um, for a minute back in cannabis. I'm like, you know what? This is what I really want to do. I knew it. I know everybody had time to spend with themselves and right, had realized, right. you know, like, and so I realized, like, I find myself happiest in cannabis. So um, I sought out to look for another in, um, job in cannabis. Uh, whether it be grow or um, marketing or uh, look corporate uh, right. at another shop, like it was like, what's up? Even now, like I'm like, okay, we're talking legal shops now. That's where it's at. Like, let me see what's good, man. And I I ran into I guess a lot of white places. Like I hate I hate to say it like that, but they was turning mm-hmm. me down left and right when I know, in fact, I have plenty of experience. You right, know. Right. <laughs> Here I ain't been at two shops. And it's not and a surprising grow. though. That like, shit ain't surprising. <laughs> not at all. And so uh my current jo- job right now, uh, shout out 64 and Hope. They got my heart off shout of La out. Siena, off La Cienega and Guthrie, y'all. 2000 South La Cienega Boulevard and Mid City. And then we have one in up the street off Melrose and La Brea off Holly in the Hollywood area. Um We've been open for a year and a half now. So uh, they were just starting uh, female, black owned, uh, LGBTQ um, supporting. That's dope. When she, (laughs) I love the sound. When she, when Asia uh, was hiring people, the female who was owning people, like she really had her hands on and she really taught us. She's been over our heads like since day one. Like, I got y'all, we in this together, you know, we doing this. You know, you guys are selling my our products, but this is your store. You know, this is That's us. Love, yeah. You know, so we felt nothing but love since then. And they take care of me. We got fire weed. We got fire. Just yep. if you got want flour, pre-rolls, THC, CBD, droplets, some drinks, whatever. Right. We got right. it. Okay. Like some vape pants, whatever. We got it. So it's fire. So once they've adopted me, I just felt like, oh, wow, I could really find myself in the like influencer spot. I really like felt more hands on and felt like I could like. Uh, branch out and once I did turn that light bulb on I was on the internet and just seeing like how many people are really like you know influencing and really right. testing products right. and really t- talking to the people and, and involved in the community and all that so it was just like you know what let me really get out here and I actually thought about potty mouths like six years prior to that or to now so I was like you know what let me Tackle at that again. Right. People are seeing me. I'm talking to people. I'm really talking. I'm getting, I'm actually talking back to my sex talk that I used to talk about. And so here comes Potty Mouths, and which is my cannabis sex talk podcast, in which we smoke good, talk dirty. (laughs) Yeah. uh, We, I just sit down with a male and female individual. I think we're going to double it up now. And um, we just dissect some things, you know? Um, I'm going to get a little nastier, so I don't want to say too much, right, but... Right, right, <laughs> right. Follow me up, YouTube uh, slash Court and Sesh, and you're going to see Potty Mouse. I'm go- I called it just, well, I, my page is Court and Sesh because I have other things that I'm going to come out with. So Potty Mouse to start. Just uh, follow up and subscribe, and yeah. 
I feel right. like I'm doing a lot of talking. They gave me some THC drinks, guys. Right, so right. No, that's good. We want to know. We want to know. Yeah, because it's about it's about you though. You know what I'm saying? So look, I want like like not not to cut you off, but like yeah, check out the Potty Mouth podcast. But you know what I'm saying? Just for those of us who don't know, like all right, it's Potty Mouth. We may have a, like a little small idea of what that may be, but give us like a little snippet of like something or, or, or certain topics that come across the Potty Mouth table. All right. Um, hmm. I'll give you an idea. Uh, so, like, um, what, who I'm looking at? Okay, so we're a little tardy to get today, guys. It's my fault. I masturbated. Okay. That's right. That's it happens. Right. So yeah. those are topics yeah. that come previously. Across the previously, okay. before then, I was uh, at a off at the office uh, doing the editing on my on my behalf, and we were drinking some Hennessy, and I was like, damn. I think I'm gonna have to rub one off before I uh, yeah. do my next venture, and so I did. Yeah. And so Man, these are things that we openly discuss and break down. <laughs> yeah, and that's something a lot of people um, go yeah, through, yeah. experience, and talk. You know what I'm saying? So, and it's nothing wrong with doing that. You know nothing yeah. wrong at all. Yeah, but no. we definitely just throw everything out there. Right. Yeah, and, right. It, and it's dope too, though, because I I don't watch a few episodes. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And it's like the topics oh. that come across. It's it's certain things that a lot of people, I'm not going to even say certain, a lot of people be scared people to talk about. Talk about. about. Yeah. You know, but then it's like, I know you be in your motherfucking head. Like, mm-hmm. 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 but like the Potty Listen. World podcast, you can go right there and be like, ah, so that's what's that popping. Off, man, yeah. so let's so check that out, man. Everybody, so everybody just comes up to me and be like, ooh, we should talk about it. And I'm like, all right, when the cameras is in your face <laughs> and the lights is on, <laughs> it's a different story. <laughs> <laughs> on the real, like like the one episode where y'all was talking about like giving some head and mm-hmm. stuff like that, giving head. So like for you, do you prefer like giving head first or getting it uh, second? I it got. I feel like guys are always spoiled, so I want to be sure that I will in fact be taken care of. Mm-hmm. I could dig it. I could dig it. And there's been uh, there's been a, situ- a couple of situations <laughs> where it'd be like. Dang, like you ain't gonna not hit you ain't gone. <laughs> but it shouldn't be a problem though for the man to take the a- first exactly. step. You know what I'm saying? And, Listen, and, 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 and honestly, and in, I would that, rather the man yeah. who would just go, go and dive right, in. Right. Gives me the more comfortability to also go and dive in. Yep. And here we are. Yep, that's a fact. So have there sure. been those times to where it's been like, all right, you done went down there, you done went first, but it's like, mm, it's cool. It wasn't that exciting. And then you just get on. Hmm. Like he gave me, it wasn't cool, yeah. it wasn't exciting. Then yeah, I'll give like, him one cool, wasn't exciting. <laughs> okay. So he should get a little Like I said, the real person is going to yeah. dive in, and once they dive in, then yeah, we going to yeah. dive in, I and we going to have a gonna fun be that time. Vibe. Yeah, I for sure. Like, I would hope that anybody who's coming to the kitchen is ready to cook. So. Yeah, yeah, that's real that's shit. That's potty mouth shit. Period. Yeah. <laughs> so as far as being um, um, working in the in- cannabis industry, like with the dispensaries mm-hmm. and stuff, so you, we, how long ha- were you a bud tender? Is that what you still do now? I'm with the still, dispensary? I'm still a bud tender now. Technically, we call ourselves advocates. Dope, we are more dope. keen about our shit. Right. I like right. that. We I know. Get, we know our advocate. shit. Yeah. So now we um. We definitely assist customers more than anything uh, personally, um, as opposed to definitely like a bud tender. It's just like, we got this, that, this, that. Three grams? All right. Oh, your back hurt? That one. Like. Right, right. Don't, <laughs> I don't even know what the fuck, you know, just know it gets you high. Oh, that right, would get you high. It's right, fuck, right. So Let me one. weigh it. Ba 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 ba. 20. Boom. Ba. Mm. Yeah. Oh, so that's dope. Mm-mm-mm. So you have a lot of knowledge about the stuff that y'all say. I like this, to think we do, definitely. That's dope. For sure about our things. And I, I'm also the brand, amb- uh, brand ambassador for 64 Hope too. That's dope. So if you check us out on our page or on yep. our website, you'll see me. Yeah, yep. check them out. <laughs> Tap cool, in with them. Into yeah, you guys can follow up at, um, you'll spell it out, 64andhope.com and yep. or um, Instagram at 64andhope. Yeah, we'll get it up there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah they're going to see it. Mm-hmm, sure. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. On the real. I just forgot what I was going to say. Did I throw you off with the potty? Why why you, I why love you to do it. it. Oh, you, I, <laughs> you heard what she said? She said, did she throw you off? Because I'm with the potty nah. mouth. 
Uh-uh. No, because no. it was uh-huh. something about the potty mouth. Oh. <laughs> Are you still dwelling on it over there? <laughs> oh man, it, it, it threw me off though. But one thing, one thing, I was like thinking, like when you was talking, like from like the early days starting off, the consistency you had, like as far as you like going and like your mark in the, mm-hmm. in the industry. You kept on going, and it's like you wasn't the same, though. It's like you yeah. learned different routes. Different routes, Like how yeah. you say, oh, this is your vegetation. Oh, this is how you're doing this right here. Yeah, yeah. It's like along your road, you stuck to it. You know what I'm saying? That's, yeah. I just wanted to like point that out to you. That's commendable because thank a lot you, of motherfuckers, mm-hmm. they like hit that pandemic, and it's like, it's shh, like, it ain't uh, for me. Well, I mean, there's there's been people who have put billion millions and thousands of dollars in it i know a couple of people who just like yeah we had this going but mm, we didn't have good sales or this hit us and so they're either trying a different route or they're out the game so don't get me wrong it i mean i didn't invest too much financially in the situation but my own energy but um thank you i definitely did want to um put my hands all over cannabis and i still want to see what I could do corporately um, because, I mean, eventually I want to have a strain or um, I want to sell some products of my own, Um, rather be a grinder or a vibrator. Um, I'm looking into it. Facts. Facts. I like that. (laughs) What kind of vibrator would it be? I don't know. I'm kind of jealous of the rose. Like, I mean, (laughs) I'm hearing such good things about it. I yeah. am. It's like, dang. The rose, huh? Yeah. It's just so cute and convenient. I mean. Yeah, I've been seeing a lot of yeah, shit on Instagram. It's, be, it, it's so much yeah, of that aesthetics yeah. more than anything, I think. Yeah. Huh. It's yeah. the amp up. Just to amp it up. It, I, I think it is. I mean, it's just, it is. You can put that in your purse, whatever. Now, the big guy I got. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, uh, obviously, you can't put that in your purse, right. but it's a whole little situation. Um where it has the suction over the vagina. Um, and I guess it's particularly for the clit, yeah, because it has a little tongue part, and it goes... <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like it's the, pretty deep. Yeah. With those, it's like even though they got those, mm-hmm. all y'all little toys, you know what I'm saying, women play with, is those, like, you know what I'm saying, is, is that really better than getting the real thing? Oh, no, of course not. Of so course it's like, not. So it's just like That's a little teaser. One of, a main reason why I probably could never be a lesbian. Right. Shout out to the lesbians. I love y'all. And right. y'all know I do. Right. Y'all know I do. Yeah. Like, women are beautiful. Y'all feel good. Y'all soft. I could even take sometimes your attitude. It'd be like, girl, I'll yeah. just feed you. <laughs> 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 yeah. But, it just, yeah, you said you need at that the end of the day, yeah. I do, I do. Yeah. Someone try to, try to tell me about that. Like, ooh, I got a good strength. Right, right. That strap ain't no throbbing veined meat. Right. That's yeah, attached to warm, it's a, warm. It's a okay, it's a big difference. Yeah, it's, it's, a so, big it's, difference. So. Yeah. Ooh, it's a big difference. Who's the big difference? I must say. Man. So. <laughs> <laughs> For real. <laughs> but um, as far as like off. like how how. Fuck it, shit. How freaky have you got, though, as far as have you been with it? That's the thing. I don't want people to think that with this show, I'm just oh so freaky. Okay. I just, I'm just disgustingly freaky. Right. Right. I'm conversationally freaky. But that's like pretty much where it's at, though. Because I I haven't even done a threesome. Huh. Okay. Right. I haven't even fully messed with a girl. Okay. But a lot of people think that shit, though. I know, right? They see that and they're like, oh, she. They would assume. Oh, she. I know, I know. Right. I, I stopped to think, Stop like, maybe I should address y'all. that. No, it's it. <laughs> Stop assuming, y'all. <laughs> I, stopped, I stopped to think, like, what if I address that one day? Like, uh-huh. listen, y'all, like, I'm really not a full freak. Like, I don't even want it in my ass. Uh-huh. At all. Yeah, I've seen that. You, At you all. You talked about that on your show, yeah. No, nah, but, like, you, you know what I'm saying? You can see that, though. It's like, it's a lot of people, no, nah, I may not do this shit, but I uh-huh. think it. You know right, what I'm saying? it's like so. It's like, all right, dang, I can, it's somewhere I can go with other motherfuckers talking about this. Just shit. I'm talking about too. it, really? Uh-huh. I'm you know what saying, all right, shit. Let, let me let it off. That's what, like, that's right, what the platform said, is for. Yep, yep. Let that's it off. Right. Let it off. <laughs> Period. <laughs> so, um, do you um see yourself like getting into like as far as marketing, like modeling and different shit like that, or have you done anything like that? Um, I used to model. Okay. Um. 
long ago. Um, right. <laughs> <laughs> I, I mean, I've been doing cannabis modeling and anybody who's up for that and um, doing some marketing in that, I'm definitely down for it. Um, I definitely just see myself doing a lot of things past this. Uh, yeah. Potty mouse could definitely grow. Um, yeah. A lot of people want to sure. talk. Yeah. There's a lot of real freaky people that's like, yeah. what's up? Oh, like, <laughs> what's happening? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think I was real PG-13 this first go around, honestly. Yeah. Like, so there's that. So look, give us, you know, you mentioned a little earlier, you're going to get a little more detailed and shit on the show. Give us a small sample of what kind of stuff, you know what I'm saying? You're going to get a little. I mean, we're talking like it. It's okay, just that. Sure. So I think everybody is, is, is faded right now. Yeah. And we just dig into something. Oh, so, I mean. So pretty much you come up to the party mouse, you're gonna like pretty much smoke you something, have you a little sip and just Yeah, and we just talk chat. away. I'll I'll ask my uh guests, uh, do they particularly know of something or just like and and we'll secretly sesh before that and right. talk before that right. and see what just comes right. up. But uh, then I have to be like, stop, don't talk too deep deep into it. <laughs> right, right, right. Because I want it to be organic. Like yeah, I want yeah. you to really dive into it in there. And we could dive. I mean, yeah. so, so oh, go ahead, go on. No, so I don't have to necessarily just be like potty mouth to uh, topics. It can be like what things that's trending across, or just strictly just potty mouth shit. I don't want to say strictly, but we're kind of talking dirty over here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that's the lane. That's the lane. So I mean, you could say what's uh, currently going on if it's a little dirty. All right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Only dirty news. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so as far like um as far as being close to you know um you know, the the owner of the dispensary that you work at, mm -hmm. um have you seen some of the challenges she went through, or did she have any challenges? She definitely goes through challenges yeah. all the time, and I mean she's like that good parent that, you know, you don't see them stressing or right. or arguing with anybody. Right. Like, she'll definitely just hold her head up high. Like, and I'm sure if she just stopping, if you like ask her like, so what's what's your troubles now? Or, or right. what's going through now? She'll probably, you know, whew, but you know, she's pushing through and we making sales and we're <laughs> handling business like, yeah. like a boss. Cause that's yeah, what that's she right. is, the boss lady. And that's what we call her. That's right. Yeah, <laughs> that's cool. She got it seem like it's a cool team. Like no, definitely, with. we're oh, a family you know. up there. Like, period. Yep. Eat the machine. And it's a, it's a lot of challenges right now in the industry. In with, the industry, with period. smaller businesses, we talk about that shit all the time. All the time, I'm sure. Yeah, <laughs> with, yeah. With um, you know, it's a lot of businesses not even being able to survive, as you said a few minutes ago. You know what I mean? Period. Period. And the shit, that's some no, fucked I, up shit. You you see that shit all the time, and. Yeah, support can only go so far, but I swear all the time I'm thinking about just marketing either for that store or myself or Potty yeah. Mouth or <laughs> yeah. period. Like, um, but that's that's yeah. that's the best way to do it though. You got to stay diligent and keep going, keep pushing. Absolutely. You can't, you know, Absolutely. even though a motherfucker might get uh, frustrated, discouraged at times. You just got to keep pushing up. No, yeah. seriously, life consistent. will throw you some obstacles. Somebody took my card the other day. I'm looking yeah. at my account like 298 at Ross. <laughs> mm. I do not. <laughs> Taco El Unico. I'm sorry, I don't even eat there. That's an instant headache. Man. <laughs> Man. Like phones, all of this shit. Like, strange, and I'm like, like, I got a show to produce right now. Like, come on, man. Hot about it. But yeah. Life will definitely throw you curveballs, mm -hmm. as it does in the industry and shit. Period. You just gotta get up, roll you on, and keep it moving. Keep it pushing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I swear, I'll just sit and just. Mm. For real, for real. <laughs> Look, I'm a girl. I don't know about you guys, but I like will schedule a cry if I need to. I'll be like, mm. all right, when I go home, yep, close the door. <laughs> <It's> <laughs> lock it up, lock the shit. windows, and just yeah. talk about some shit. Let that shit out. Let me tell you, for your mental health, 
I ain't even doing no male shit. Push that ego pride to the side. Let that shit out one time. It's okay yeah. to feel, feel, feel. That's a fact, yeah. Especially in, yeah, in, 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 in certain situations and stuff, though. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> to wipe your tears while you smoking, shit. man, smoke it's a cool little shit. feeling. Yep. I ain't gonna lie. First of all, like it's a proven fact. Smoke, um, excuse me, crying feels naturally good. Like it might be sad in the moment, but it's literally pouring out. And if you like manifest and like really believe in just like, you're literally pouring out the sadness. If you mm. could think about it, mm. you're literally tearing out that out. So just let That's it a out. Good way to look at it. Let it out. Let it out. Let it out. And it might not be the end of it. I'm not saying that, but let that shit out. Roll you one. And when you roll that, roll that shit up with intention. Mm -hmm. Roll that up like, man, we gonna tuck this shit for now. You know, handle it. We felt about it. We're gonna and and do something about it now. Yeah, yeah I do that with pops. Do something like with my pops. Now. He passed away years ago, and, and we was close. My, my condolences. Yeah, for sure, for sure. So you know, I I, I get in them little moments sometimes, and that, yeah, it ain't nothing wrong Snatch with on. it. You know what I'm saying on the real. <laughs> on the real. <laughs> for real. Nigga be right. smoking yeah. like a motherfucker too. Man, just pull that shit back. You said earlier you wanted your own strain. What is it? A indica, sativa, hybrid. Indica. Indica. Only. Uh, so what? <laughs> like, what's the name of it? What you naming this brand? I don't know. No, don't say it. Don't say it. When it come, we we'll know. Uh, I mean, yeah, right. I mean, I'll probably have to start with an original. No, not like Court and Session. It'll have to be like a real supreme name. Uh, you see, she having well, supreme thoughts already. Right. That shit, that shit already getting you out. Supreme. I was, I was Supreme Court first. So. Uh, Supreme yeah, Court OG. So, so you <laughs> prefer well, indica. So, uh, which which you have a favorite strain? You know, it's funny. I used to love me some King Louis. King Louis. But I think I've been used so to. turned out on the exotics now. Huh? Because <laughs> it's do. a lot of them that hit hard as a motherfucker yeah, too. Yeah, they do. Somebody was like just pressing. It was like I don't like exotics. I don't like that fruity flavor. I'm like, what? Then what do you like? OG. Huh. I was like, all right. That's yeah. the way to think about it. Oh, everything. Listen, I've been yeah, working with we, weed all this time, and I was like, damn, I guess that is the keen difference. There's the exotics with those flavors, and not even a fruity flavor, but just like, mmm, an exotic flavor. And then it's that OG. It's just a solid. Just You uh -huh. just going to catch that high before the, more than the flavor, though. That's more than the flavor, yeah. But I'm not scared to try the exotic Okay. Yeah. But who? I, I don't go, know like, anybody. I really I fuck prefer with both, Indica. now. I think I fuck with both. Uh, okay, yeah. Uh -huh. I don't know nobody. I'll say, I mean, you weird. Like, who just say a do do exotics? Must be real bougie. I mix my shit too, though. I mix the OG. But I definitely exotics, have so. some guys that come into the shop and be like, I'm just looking for an OG. Of course, they are OG. Right, right, right. <laughs> <on everything. laughs> they a damn OG. They damn so. So yeah. it's like, all right, OG, I, I got some of this for you over here. As soon as I say that, King Louis, um, they'll they'll spark. Um, what else? Uh, there's a couple of I, I'm I'm a sucker for a runts. A runts, yeah, I fuck with the runts too. Like, and that's just like these recent strains. If we're talking about like brands, um, I really been liking like originals. They don't do me wrong. Yeah, they have a nice. Yeah, my flavor. favorite, um, the Gorilla Glue number four. Mm, okay, yeah, always yeah. sort of back right there. Uh, okay, but I'll probably venture out. I go, like around, I go around the corner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you can you can rarely find the Skywalker high was. Uh -huh. You know, but the Gorilla Glue is like that's next to Ken. Uh -huh. You we know what I'm saying? It seems like the Gorilla Glue is what like You heard what put. she said though? We have the Skywalker. Okay. <laughs> where where at though? At 64 and Hope, 2000 yeah. La Cienica Boulevard. Facts. I like yeah. that too though. And it's like like some like really a lot of the times though, like how you say the shop is, mm -hmm. like you can Talk to the customer. Yeah, you know what I'm saying the customer. No, can like talk back. You know, what I'm saying that's that's. I really I don't know. That's important. It's that's so vital. important, mm -hmm. especially like stoner to stoner. Yeah. We're just like really vibing on a feeling or like one thing that we did or like something really? that we smoked. Like it really does. It really does matter. You'll get your big difference. You'll get your uh -huh. you'll get your random asshole here and there, and it's like, bro, what what do you need out of here? Yeah. <laughs> what, what, <laughs> where should I direct you? Because you like. <laughs> Not no, in here. No, but like that, that <laughs> home and feeling right there, you can just talk yeah. and just like, I don't know, that probably make your sesh once you leave even better. Yeah, you know no, once definitely. You have a good mm -hmm. I definitely like uh, mm -hmm. appreciate helping a customer, vibing with a customer. It definitely um, helps the 
overall store vibe and everybody just feel good. Like, mm -hmm. and I love when they come in, especially when people be like, uh, my friend came here. They said it's like really cool. So like I'm here to check it out. And then they have a really cool experience. <laughs> <laughs> like when like, they oh come God, back on oh, every like, Hell yeah. And then they're telling their next friend. So we just keep getting word of mouth and like uh, a lot of um, neighborhood neighbors. <laughs> it's crazy. People be like, you guys just get here? Nah, we going on two years, sis. But right. um, stick around. <laughs> did y'all do a, like a grand opening yeah, kind of no, thing? Yeah, no, we definitely did. We definitely did. And then we had an uh, anniversary um, September 24th. Somebody's huh. going to kick my head if I said the wrong date. Huh, but that's dope. That's definitely our anniversary. It was yeah, my birthday, birthday September 25th. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. It might be that date, low key. <laughs> 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 I'm like, shit, that's right. not what I'm looking at. They're going to be so bad. But no, y'all, that's the date. That's the date. That's uh -huh. just, we have that's been there, right. whatever. We just been, we just been open that whole like month, honestly, just, um, Soft opening and just being in there and stuff and building a family. So we was open in September. That's period. right. That's right. <laughs> bottom <laughs> line. Yeah, bottom line. Uh -huh. oh, everything. So so what other kind of things are you into besides uh the cannabis? Sex and cannabis? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, besides sex and cannabis. Yeah. What other things um, interest you? Man, what other things? Yeah. Um I really Sex like. And I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> no, oh, I've really category? been. I've really been appreciating throwing wow. um, events. I always love throwing events. Yeah. Like that like is a such party like planning. a yeah, Event like that's planning. such a, a a hidden talent of mine. And like I love that my coworker had pointed it out one day, and I was like, "Yes, that's what I do. Like I love this shit." <laughs> <laughs> so like when I did the premiere for Potty Mouse, like I had um, somebody come in with a table of sea moss. I have Bloom uh, with their cartridges. I had Clay Nine with their weed. Um, Kronja uh, uh, with their weed. Um, Ooh La La with their drinks. Uh, and um, we had a naughty a naughty girl at the table. She was coming on everybody. Uh, oh man, squirting and shit. No, nah, she Just had like a, she had like a confetti game, and it's so uh, funny. Every <laughs> every other like thirty minutes, you just hear like a. <laughs> Oh, yeah, like, okay. and it's like she <laughs> came. Like, oh, she just came on somebody. How can I take your order? Like yeah, it was yeah. so fun. And Unreal. then um, it was a crazy situation because I had twerk instructors, and um, it's so weird. I'll I'll let you guys know exclusively. Like they ran out on me. I won't say their names and stuff like that. But it was a punk ass move. They had told me. One punk of them had told move. me in advance. Uh, well, before at the party, like it's a lot of guys here, but it's like you're a twerk instructor. Right. Now, you're a tour constructor for women. I get it. But, like, I'm not asking her to strip at right. all. Like, literally, all she's going to be doing is like a... Right. 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 <laughs> okay. Right. Nothing too strenuous. Nothing too sexual at all. But um, she said uh, she felt uncomfortable. There was a lot of guys in there. Then I looked around. I was like, it's a lot of guys in here. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> she's on some Ponzi shit. And then I was like... Oh, really? No, it's okay. You can leave on your your sweats or whatever. That's fine. And I'm hearing her other friend might have been a stripper or something. I'm not sure. Um, so I'm not. I wouldn't understand the problem. So I was like, Yeah, okay. We're going. We're going um, to have the twerk dancers uh, next. You guys just stay tuned. <laughs> Five minutes. I'm like looking for these hoes and they gone. And the homegirl just came out of nowhere. She was like, what? They left, Courtney. Don't trip. Don't trip. Give me five minutes. I'm about to go to my car. Don't trip. Don't trip. I had a whole strip show huh. at my shit. Huh. A whole strip huh. show. They, they had the, what the, the boss pulled out the dollars. Like, man, listen. It was cracking. Eh? It was cracking. Huh. Like, that's, that's, a, that's a Courtney Sesh event right there. But right. it wouldn't be nothing without my, you know, my fam and my support. So, like, I love it. I loved everything that was there. I, I didn't even get a chance to get mad at the bitches leaving. Right. I was just like, they left. Right. <laughs> and right. it was just like, what do I do now? <laughs> but, okay. Oh, and then they were just like, like don't right trip, in, don't like, trip. Right. We got this. Yeah. We got it, Court. So, I'm like, okay. Ladies and gentlemen. 
<laughs> and it and seemed the, like they had a, a better a time. A better than what them fucking time. Did. Like, so yeah. I I couldn't be happier. I uh, couldn't be happier. Like so, uh, that's just my other hidden talent. That's <laughs> right. For real. For real. On the real. So like, do you um smoke while you sucking a dick? <laughs> <laughs> that would make my mouth too dry. Uh, okay. So, he thought he was going to throw me. <laughs> he didn't. Nah, I didn't think I was going to throw you. This nigga just... He, he threw know, him no. for sure. He was like, look, oh, shit, look, he asked for that. No, this nigga just threw me off because he started laughing. <laughs> <laughs> shit, man. <laughs> Man, <laughs> no, nah, that would be oh, way shit. too dry to like, combo. Man, if anything, like, I'm even gonna if you had some water, you that know what I'm do would you want me? Do, would you want me to if, perform or or smoke the? Uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> exactly. A little bit of both. Blow what, it on there. What? <laughs> and then you gonna be like, "Fuck that! Let me hit it!" Right? <laughs> man. All right. Uh, now, have yeah, I had man. sex in and smoked? Yeah. yeah. But yeah. even then, so yeah. it's just like, all right, yeah, let's you ain't put really this tripping off out. that. Yeah. yeah. It's yeah. like yeah. we're That's here time, now. You know yeah. We're performing now. Oh, oh, every time. It's like, shit, nigga, it's time to go to work. Yeah. You should have been. You got your high on now. Come on. Let's Man, go. For real. no, I just, oh no, we just, we, we really like the, uh, the party, just the aspect of just the party balls. So, we, like we like that. We like that. I like that. You like that. We probably, we probably want to come over there. You know what I'm saying? So we can just be like, all right, what about no this shit right uh, here? Nah, uh, no, no, you know I'm gonna see what's good. Just so, uh, you know what I'm saying? Just so like your viewers and everybody, you know, so they know that like it's other people out there. That's okay. where support, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, we come that's out. That's right. You know, no, no problem, fellas. Yeah. We can for sure do that. Oh, that's right. like fun. That's like adult fun nowadays. It really is. It <laughs> yeah. really is. That's that good free talk. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Just free talk. Like, are we talking now? Are we doing this podcast thing? Because when I did think about it, it was just like a camera that's dope, and though. face and YouTube. Like, <laughs> um, yeah. so now we upload the RSS and all that. So, <laughs> and it's like another cool thing about it too. Though. It's like you have both. On your like when you do your show, you have a male and a female. Yeah, so yeah. Get, different. You get perspective. different perspectives. Different perspectives. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, and it's like I, I kind of like it because the the fellas be on there like, what the mm -hmm, like what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm telling you, and, and I, now I gotta I gotta double it up. I gotta have another guy. I gotta have another girl. Mm -hmm. So yeah, we gotta be like, yeah, mm -hmm. it's gotta have That's that double cool. dy dynamic, yeah. us against them. Huh. 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 Uh, on the real, yeah. on the real. <laughs> I can see that. Yeah. Man, uh, yeah, I'm high as a motherfucker <laughs> on, on me. <laughs> right now. <laughs> <laughs> Man, brain fog. Like, Man. damn, nigga, what's uh... <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Uh -huh. Let Take me see. Uh, Get everything together, mm -hmm. brother. Uh -huh. Got me off this THC. That's why that editing Dream. is good, though. Just have, just got my words just blah, 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 What right all you put mouth. in it though? Just the Migos and um, shit, both the Arnie's and then some of Lazy Bone. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, you, should, you right then. Listen, I I'm out of here. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, and I'm drinking this? Damn it. Man, so like seeing some of the stuff that your, um, that your boss go through uh, with, with the challenges and shit like that, would you want to open a dispensary or would you shoot for some shit like that? Um, I probably wouldn't shoot for a dispensary. It definitely has its um, challenges. Man, do I commend her. Yeah. Man, do I commend her. Shout out boss lady. Um, but I definitely want to, you know, get somewhere up in there. Yeah. So I, it, I, it's just a matter of getting licensed and, all the other stuff, whether it be, um, well, if it's just regular material, like I said, the rolling tray, or excuse me, the grinder and a rolling that's tray different. or yeah. papers and stuff like that, that that's shouldn't different. be too hard at all. No, that's just a matter of going to the smoke district and be like, hey, can you press some of this? That's it. <laughs> like, yeah. that's it. Trademark so, look, around this motherfucker. That's it. You know what I mean? Whoa, oh, this shit. Yeah. So if, that, <laughs> if like the, the paperwork aspect of it, if it was like, Easy to get through, easy to obtain and stuff like that. Would you want to go and get a shop then? I really wouldn't want to shop. That means I still have to employ people. I still have yeah, to okay. deal with uh, 10 to 12 personalities. Yeah. 
in the market. Listen, and the that's like your kids. Yeah. We're her kids. And but, but every time she hears some shit, she got to be like, all right, children. <laughs> huh. You know? Yeah, I can see that. It, it, that'd probably be different. Of and it, it's, not, it's, like, it's nothing to her. Like, her personality, she's... That's why I, I asked her one time, like, are you trained for this? Like, yeah, did you take some training? Because some, some people definitely do need it. Or she's made yeah. for it. And I really think she's made for it. Like, yeah. she she just, that's a strong bitch. That's one thing <laughs> I be saying, too, though. Like, if you're in the cannabis industry, find your lane. You know what I'm saying? If that's what you're yeah, in, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Stay in that one. You no, don't have to go above or no, whatever. No, no, no. Uh-huh. If you choose to, you learn the shit, you get up there, you get up there. But mm-hmm. if this your lane, you know what I'm saying? Stay yeah. in that one. No, okay. definitely. Um, if I did open a shop, a shop, excuse me, I would uh, put it in my name. But, like, have somebody else run it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I come through with my purse, like, <laughs> That'll be the way to go. What is it for real though? That's for the real. way to go. Uh, excuse me. How do you feel about this one? Uh, yeah. <laughs> okay, get, that's nice. Uh-huh. That's nice. <laughs> Would you get into the grow aspect of it? Would you fuck with that lane? I, I, to to fuck with that lane, I would have to. No, that's, that's patience, me. Huh? Yeah, yeah, that's patience. patience. That's getting my hands dirty. That's learning more. Um, and a, don't get me wrong, that's definitely a lane. That's definitely a lane. Yeah. If you could just uh, master like the key way to just grow some things, uh, grow. Uh, excuse me, just uh, do a session of grow oh, via right. YouTube. Oh. Not even YouTube. Pay for your. How can somebody pay for your shit? Like have classes. Right. Mm-hmm. Everybody just have different plants. Mm-hmm. Come through, and we're still, we're still, or, or th- your plan is there, and you're just watching it grow, and we're at this class, and we're just like continue learning about it, and boom, you take it home. You either put it in your, um, you can either have a inside thing, whole situation where you plug it up, you have the whole light, the uh, kit, or you can have it outside. Make sure you have enough sunlight. You know, mm-hmm. we'll teach you so far, and that's how you keep your shit nutritious. This, I'm giving y'all some gems out here tonight. Mm-hmm. Oh. A whole lot of them. But it, but it, and it is so many different ways that <laughs> you can attack it's the so industry. It's so many ways you could be in this industry. That's, I need my black I'm people like, to know. Oh, like, listen, you could rap. You could um, be a ball. Uh, in, you could ball. You could uh, be a hustler. Yep, sell a merch. You could do all that. Shit. That's, what, that's, that's what Getting we push shit. Yep. Yep. <laughs> Getting this shit. Like, seriously, if you really stop... And invest in this shit, even learn some shit like, and like, they're always looking for master growers. Mm. They're always looking for mm-hmm. master growers. And if you don't know what a master grower is, it's like growers are his co- employees. Yep. <laughs> the yep. master grower is just that the person who masters all the grow. Yep. <laughs> he know the main shit. He's gonna be the one say, all right, turn that off, turn that, make sure that is fed. Um, did you check that? Okay. Uh. Uh-uh. That one, those need to be moved out of there now. <laughs> All yeah. that shit. It seemed easy, but that shit is complicated. Man, mm-hmm. because lights go off or um, you have, yeah, you have some electrical problem. Lights go off for like yeah, 10 man. hours. Boom, mm-hmm. you just messed up. You might, you might have, you might have had your shit, you might have had your shit, um, what you call it? When plants have seeds, in a lot of cases, they'll get too much dimness. And so, or yeah, they'll start to do this whole regrowing situation again. And it's like, ah, no, take it out the light now or take it out the dark. It's one of them. I'm rusty, y'all. Right, 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 right. <laughs> but it's a, it's a way that your shit grow where it be like, oh, I got a seed. It's obviously not a good thing, but yeah, someone kept the light off or kept it on too long. Mm. <laughs> Man. Yep. <laughs> For real, yeah, those some gems though. Those some gems. Look. Uh, she just wrote it down. Uh, for real, <laughs> he got the gig. So tell us, what's next for court? What's what, what, what's next for court? What's uh. next? Oh man, oh, I got a Valentine's um event coming up at sixty four and Hope. Oh, and. Um, that's the shop, right? That is the shop. Two thousand oh. Los, Los 
2000 North La Cienega Boulevard. Oh. Excuse my eyes. They cross very crazy. Tap in. <laughs> I also have one later on that night uh, featuring speed dating for my singles. Okay. Huh. We got some tequila in there. Uh-huh. Okay. That's fucks right. with me. Fucks with me. So it's Follow me. Right. Stay That's tuned. Hey, tap in with it. Is this like a session date? Y'all going to be doing that? Yes, like yes. It, 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 oh, my God. It's going to be consumption. Consumption speed dating. Come on. Huh, that's dope. That's super dope. Come on. And that's just a feature, okay? We <laughs> got some other entertainment <laughs> and other things coming through. How much so. time you get on the speed day? Um, great question. Uh, we haven't broke down details yet, but right. stay tuned. Right. Follow me at Court and Sesh. Tap in. Tap, tap. Follow up. Stay tuned. I got you guys. For sure, for sure. Yeah. yeah. So look, we thank you for coming in and uh, chilling thank you with for us. Having me. Yeah, for fun. sure, for sure. So look, man, we thank y'all for tapping in with the Best Way to Smoke podcast. Tell them where, where they can find you at. At Court and Sesh on Instagram, C O U R T, letter N S E S H. No, it's not Corniche. I don't know why people <laughs> say that. For real. It pisses Get me it off. right. Get it right. And on YouTube slash Please. Court in Sesh. Oh, tap in. Potty you can hit my website, www.courtinsesh.com. It's in development. It's coming. So, yeah. But, yeah, follow me, especially if you want to attend the speed dating event. It will be in Los Angeles, preferably like Culver City ish. Yeah. Sure, for sure. Best way, Big J. Serpo Jr., make sure you hit the like button and <laughs> subscribe and <laughs> tell a friend. Hit <laughs> him with that, baby, baby. Baby, baby. Thank y'all for getting nasty with me. Oh, real, yeah. <laughs>